Hi folks, I'm Ian Baker, the product specialist here at American RV. Today we're going to talk about the 2016 Sport Trek 320. This is a beautiful triple slide quad bunk floor plan, nice and open and spacious. But let's go ahead and start out on some of the outside features. So right up front here we're going to have our power tongue jack, nice and simple to operate. Just have one switch right here. Other side is going to be a control for our light, which is going to help assist us in hooking up and unhooking at night. Also we have extra assistance right here with the LED light that's going to be built in right to the front. Right here is going to be our propane tank cover. We just have a couple thumb screws to undo and then this will lift up. And as you can see right there is going to be two 20 pound propane tanks. The nice thing about 20 pounders is if you can't find a place to refill it, no problem. You can just take those to your local gas station and swap them out. Behind that of course is going to be our battery box and then behind that is going to be our diamond plating. That diamond plating is really nice. It's going to help protect the front end from any rocks or anything that get thrown up by the tow vehicle. As we come around to the side of the sport truck, we can take a look here at our pass-through storage. Nice, huge pass-through storage. Very open and wide right here so we can fit in larger grills, chairs, whatever we would like. Also, you do have light in there so you can see. And you'll also have a switch that is going to control uh, some blue LED lights beneath the steps as well as one on each jack. That way you can see the steps at night. And again, if you are hooking up or unhooking, it'll allow you to see the jacks as well. Speaking of the jacks, these are going to be upgraded BAL jacks. They're going to take uh, less than half the turns that your normal jacks do. So it's going to be really simple to go ahead and crank those up and down. Definitely a nice feature when you're setting up or breaking camp. Also, we can take a look up at the top here. We'll see our power awning. That is going to be a Carefree of Colorado awning. Very uh, well-known name brand awning. Nice and simple and easy to operate. You just touch a button, it rolls out. Touch a button, it rolls back in. Underneath that will be our two marine grade outside speakers. That way you can sit out here and listen to some music. Those will be controlled by the multimedia center inside, but that is Bluetooth capable. So that way if you want to sit out here and control the music, if you have a cellular device or an uh, iPod, you can go ahead and hook up to that wirelessly and be able to do so. Getting in the coach is an absolute breeze. We have three steps, the Flexco steps right here. You'll see the first step is going to be nice and low to the ground. That way if you do have bad knees, it's not a problem getting in. You'll also have the swing out uh, uh, entry handle right here, which again just makes it nice and easy to go ahead and enter into the coach. Of course, one of our three slides is going to be right here. Uh, underneath here is going to be our Dexter axles with the aluminum rims here, which is nice. Um, also, if we pop these off, you'll see that it is going to be easy lube axles on there as well. Right here is going to be our uh, outside electric hookup, which is nice to have right there. Second entryway right here, again to get up inside to the coach, this will take us into the bathroom. It's a fantastic thing to have on your bunkhouse floor plan, because that way the kids can just run in, use the bathroom and come back out. Something else I really enjoy, not very often in a quad bunk can you get an outside kitchen, but they managed to do it in a 320. So you have four bunks and this big, beautiful, full-size outside kitchen. You'll have a light out here so you can see. Nice, large refrigerator. You can go ahead and adjust the coolness right there. Great storage up top here. You have this really nice backsplash. This is not just a paper, this is actually panel, so it's nice and easy to wipe off. Great countertop space right here. You have uh, hookups for TV. And then right here, you're going to have your outside cooktop. Also, underneath the sink, you have a sponge tray, and you're going to have an additional drawer right here. As we come around to the back of the 320, a couple things to note. One right here is going to be your ladder, so that way you can uh, easily climb up onto the roof. That way it is going to be fully walkable in case you need to do any maintenance or if you just want to get up there for a better vantage point. Also, this is going to drop down. This is going to be a storage system. It can store bikes. Uh, if you have big bins you want to put down on there, maybe you want to drop it down, use it as like an extra table, whatever you would like. Very versatile, great to have. One of the nice things about this is it is going to be fully supported by the frame because this is going to be a huck bolted frame. That's going to be a superior construction method, adds a ton of strength and rigidity to that frame so you don't have to worry about it breaking down over time. Also, if you look right here, this is going to wrap up the back and go all the way underneath. That's going to be 
your fully enclosed underbelly because it is going to be fully enclosed and heated so that way you can camp into the colder seasons. As we come around to this side, you'll have your satellite and cable hookup and also this is going to be ZAMP solar ready. So if you do want solar power, that's a great thing because this uh, does have all LED lights. All you have to do is just buy the panels. You can go ahead and plug in your ZAMP panels right here and then uh, that solar power is going to help recharge that battery. On the back, of course, this is going to be your electric connection. Uh, it is going to be detachable, so you don't have to worry about anyone cutting it and stealing it or critters running up in there. Also, black tank flush. And then right here is going to be our outside shower. So that, of course, does have hot and cold access. All right, I know there's a lot of great things on the outside. Let's go check out the beautiful and spacious inside. Welcome to the inside of the 2016 Sport Trek 320. As you can see, nice wide open floor plan. We have the two opposing slides here. You get a straight shot all the way back into the bunkhouse, just very open and spacious. And also because we have the opposing slides, we have this big beautiful kitchen here. You can take a look, we're going to have our Norcold fridge freezer. Open that up, a ton of space in there, which is great. Plenty of shelves for everything you're going to want to put in there. They are going to be adjustable shelves. And one of the things I love about the Norcold fridge, right here you can go ahead and set uh, how cold you want it so it's nice and easily adjustable. Also you can put this on auto, so what that does for you is it's going to run off propane of course as soon as you plug it into shore power. That is going to automatically switch over to electric which is going to save you on gas. So you get great countertop space throughout, you get a nice prep, service, prep surface right here, you get a light in the, or a window in the kitchen which lets in a lot of light there. Underneath you have some great storage. You can can see right there. Also we're going to have our three burner stove top here as well as our oven and you're going to have a nice deep drawer underneath which is perfect for pots and pans. Up top is going to be our microwave, another great pantry storage area right there, nice large storage, fully functional hood here with a light and a fan. Then because we have the dual opposing slides, that's going to allow us to have our center island right here. Again, they really utilize this by putting in the sink top cover so it gives you great prep surface again. These of course will obviously come out and you will have your double bowl sink with your smaller or your larger bowl on the left, smaller bowl on the right. That way it's nice and easy to wash and rinse dishes and then of course you have your stainless steel high rise faucet here. Plenty of storage in the island itself. You have a drop down sponge tray as well as a bank of three drawers and you have additional storage right here. But that's not all. They're going to fully utilize this space. This opens up on the side right here. Take a look at that. That's perfect place for a trash can. I know I personally have to try to look for a spot when I'm looking for an RV because I don't want my trash just hanging out. But right there is a perfect place for it so now you know. Also on the other side here they have a shelf built in which is again perfect place for extra pantry whether it's um, you know big bags of chips, box of cereal, whatever you want but you're going to have space for it right there. Then behind me you're going to have the extra space right here. Again you have great countertop space. You have an extra plug here so it's perfect for a place for coffee maker, toaster, whatever you want. Great storage up top here and you're going to have the storage down below. So again just a ton of galley storage. Just great storage in this kitchen. Nice, open, um, fantastic floor plan. As we move across into the slide here again you'll have more storage up top. The storage is going to run all the way through which is great. LED lights here. It is something to note they have all LED lights throughout this entire coach. It's kind of tough to see it on video but these are kind of neat because when you turn the light off this actually glows in the dark so it's nice and easy to find. Also uh, you're gonna have your sofa right here. Very long sofa. So that way if you have someone that's taller you know if they're 6'6", six, 6'7", six, six, not a problem. They can still lay all the way across here. And the thing I love about Sport Trek furniture is it's all made in house so they're gonna use a thicker density city foam so it's not going to break down as quickly on you. Also all the cushions are fully reversible so you can have your pattern side or flip it over and you can have the leather look which is uh, great not only to change the look up but also you know if you have grandkids or the kids maybe they're coming back from the beach or they have ice cream you don't want to have to stain uh, the cloth or get it wet of course you can just flip that right around just makes it nice and simple. 
Right next to the couch is going to be our dinette. Again, nice large booth dinette. This table will also drop down to give you additional sleeping space. Again, these cushions are going to be reversible on here. And you get excellent easy storage underneath. So one side right here, you'll have a pull-out tray, which makes it extremely easy. And the other side is going to have a door that opens up for you just like so. And again, just great easy access to that storage. So right here is going to be our bathroom. We can go ahead and take a look. This was the second door I showed you when you were outside. But there's going to be your sink, uh, vanity. You'll have extra storage underneath. Medicine cabinet up top with a mirror and plenty of storage there. You're going to have a tub shower with excellent shelving in it. Hand wand, of course, and a skylight up top. to let in a lot of natural sunlight and give you some extra room. And then last but not least, in the corner is going to be our stool. So again, one of my favorite things about the floor plan is how open this is from the front all the way to the back. So this is going to take us into the bunk house and you're going to have four bunks back here. So you have your top bunk right here, which that way if someone's sitting at the couch, you can just leave this up. When you're ready for bed, you can just pull that out on either side and it'll go ahead and drop down. Uh, you do get the Teddy Bear Bunk Series bunks in here, so they're nice and soft, very comfortable to sleep on. Also, it does come with the table right here, so that way if the kids want to sit back here and eat, or if they want to color, draw, do a puzzle, whatever they'd like to do, you do have that extra table. This, of course, does just come out, and great place to store it, right underneath your jackknife sofa. So you get huge storage under here, which you also do out in the living room, great storage in both of those. Again, your reversible cushions. So that's two of your bunks right there. Your third bunk's going to be right here. Again, uh, excellent full-size bunk. You'll have your your window which is going to let in a lot of natural light. You also have some coat hooks here if you want to hang coats, sweatshirts, whatever you want. And you get additional storage right here. So any storage is great storage, the additional storage right there. You also have access to your hot water heater right back here. So if you do need to access that, nice and easy to get to. Now our fourth bunk is going to be right across the way, which is right here. Uh, of course you'll have an extra light up there, place for your TV, so that way you can sit on the couch and enjoy your TV. Ladder is going to be built in, just pulls up and comes right out like so. And right here you're going to have additional storage, which is wonderful. One of the other things I like about this, it's kind of hidden storage, but this actually opens right up. And check that out, you get additional storage right behind there. Just a fantastic idea, just showing you. Um, you know how wonderful sport truck is and how they're always thinking ahead of the curve all right I know it's great back here why don't we head up front and we'll check out our entertainment center in our bedroom and the entertainment center is fantastic in the 320 you get this huge space here that way you can fit larger than a 40 inch TV there if you want so you can have a nice big TV for easy viewing also you have wonderful storage here you have this beautiful etched glass you can open that up there all right, you can see you have some controls in there for your awnings and lights. You'll also have your multimedia center right here. I mentioned this outside, but this is going to be Bluetooth capable. This is also going to be a CD player as well as your DVD player. So you can go ahead and pop a DVD in there and then watch it on your big screen. You have some extra cubby holes right here, and then you're going to get the fireplace. The fireplace really is fantastic. Not only does it look very nice, but it's also going to be extremely functional. It'll do a great job of taking the chill off in here and you get to use electric rather than using up your propane just gonna be a fantastic feature as we move up into the bedroom you notice right here you're gonna have your pocket doors which is great that way they can slide shut give you a little bit of extra privacy right behind me is going to be your TV backer location so you can put a TV right here and have your hookups right up top also all around the bed you're gonna get excellent storage you have wonderful hanging wardrobe space on both sides as well as great storage across the top you'll also get a shelf down below and both sides will have an electrical outlet so if you need to charge any cellular devices or if you have a CPAP machine you can sleep on either side of the bed last but not least you do have your queen bed here one of the things I love that sport track does is they give you this little header pillow so you can actually pull the bed down you can put that that up top of course that's where your pillows are going to go and that'll give you the full 60 by 80 residential queen just a fantastic feature that the way they give you plenty of room here for that full size so if you want to put your sheets on there and leave it a lot of people will just put that in there make the bed and then they'll never take it out just it does give you the option fantastic thing to do
All right, folks, again, thanks for joining me. This is the Sport Track 320. Ton of great features in this coach. Huge wide open floor plan. You get four bunks. You get the outside kitchen. You have the center island. The uh, couch is long enough to sleep a really tall person. Great storage underneath it. Plug ins everywhere. It has the better constructed frame, the nice easy jacks. Definitely something you want to come out and take a look at. If you do have any questions or comments, please go ahead and leave those on the video, or you can give me a call here at American RV and I'll be happy to answer them that way as well. Thanks for joining. I'm Ian Baker, and I can't wait to see you on the road to freedom.